Living in the land of 10,000 lakes, Minnesotans love to fish. And today, Jill Holter from Lake Winds Food Co-op is here to tell us how fish are not only good for us, but good for the environment. It's true. Thanks so much for coming Just in. Heating up my pan over here because we're going to get it. some searing going. So why, why is fish so good for us? Um, it's great. It's loaded with omega-3 fatty acids, so it's the good kind of fats. Mm. It's got great protein. Um, even though I just said fat, it's a it's a lean it's a fish, and there's leaner that. varieties, there's lighter varieties. It's um, more sustainable than raising beef or animals on the land. Why so is fish that? is a great Why option. Why is it so good for the environment? Um, depending on how they're raised and how they're caught. Uh, sustainable fish means that they are raised either in the ocean or farm raised in a way that doesn't harm the environment and doesn't harm the fish. Um, everybody thinks that wild caught is always better than farm raised, mm -hmm. but wild caught is a good option unless the area is overfished or unless they sure. find high mercury content or pollution in that water. Farm raised, the fish that we have at Lake Winds that we sell, the farm raised means that it's in tanks that they're not overcrowded. They don't feed them chemicals, they don't give them antibiotics. Mm -hmm. um, I brought this beautiful Chinook salmon from Ooh. Canada and that is um, farm raised but they're not crowded, they don't get antibiotics, and they're fed an all vegetarian how diet, or all know, organic diet. How can you know that it's raised in that, in that way in the farm raised? You we'll know say? what? Talk to your fishmonger, talk to the guys in the oh. butcher shop, talk to the women who sell these fish, and ask questions. Um, there's an app you can get on your phone mm -hmm. from the Monterey Bay Aquarium, and it's the Fish Watch. I'm just gonna put this OPA. What is that? That's this OPA. This is OPA, and I'm gonna tell you about it, just like, you know, the Greek OPA, right? Yeah. This Ooh. is, I know, we're gonna I sear like it. it. This is what's called bycatch. Tuna is currently overfished. Normally, I would sesame crust and pan sear ahi tuna, mm -hmm. but that's overfished right now. So we've got this OPA, which ends up in the nets with the tuna, but they don't catch as many of them, and they don't have high mercury content. So this is a oh. more sustainable option right now than ahi tuna. So look for OPA. This is caught in Hawaii, but it also can come from New Zealand and different places. Yeah. Think like does Pacific Rim. Though? It does have a similar taste. It's a little bit milder, okay. but it can be cooked in the same way. You put it in a pan, real hot pan of oil, really simple black and white sesame seeds. It makes a nice crust. You cook it for a while. You can have this kind of rare like you would tuna, mm -hmm. so you don't have to cook it for real long. It can be pink in the middle. You have other ways that you've prepared we do. some fish here, too. Yep, so this is great for firm fish. Okay. Um, these can also be grilled. Tilapia, everybody knows about. Yeah, it's a very that. mild fish, mm -hmm. so add flavor to that. Roast it in the oven or bake it in the oven. I added scallions and tomatoes and Kalamata olives. It's kind mm. of a Mediterranean. Very flavorful. Um, for, and that's tilapia right here. And then this is Dover sole. And everybody thinks that this parchment paper thing is such a mystery, but it's really, really easy. I'll just tear it open. These tender sole fillets are in here. Ooh, and they've got fennel delicious. and lemon and Ooh. just salt and pepper. And then, of course, I put some butter on it because why not? And <laughs> you cut out a heart shape of parchment paper. You lay the fish on one side, season it all up, do this, and then just fold up the edges okay. and pop it in the oven for maybe 15 or 20 minutes because they're very tender fillets. So tender fish lends itself really well to baking and parchment paper. Fantastic. Wonderful. Jill, great ideas. And I, I learned a lot about fish I and did sustainability. Too. And yeah. it smells good in here. It, it smells does. wonderful. And now you get to sample while I do weather. That sounds great. <laughs> I'll save you a bite. Uh, we'll see if the OPA is ready. That looks really yep, good. Yep, starting to brown. It'll be